Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I'll be showing you how to get mastery fast in the third C. Let's get straight into it. First off, there are a couple ways depending on what you want to get mastery for. So, if you're trying to get mastery for a fruit, let's say for my dark or something, or dough because dough is going to be awakened really soon, set your spawn point in the floating turtle mansion. Right over here, you click to interact, press yes, you set your spawn point there. And then you just come out here, and then follow where I go. And as you can see, here is a doorway, and inside is a boss called Longma. First of all, this boss gives the sword to Shida. It's a very good sword, but this boss can only be unlocked if you've already done the Tushita puzzle. So, if you haven't done that, I've got a video on how to do it. It's basically the start of the How to Get Dark Dagger video. Now, once you're here, you're going to want to kill the boss. The tactic is to run around with your dashes until your skills are on off cooldown. That way she can't reach you, but always make sure to continuously attack because if you don't continuously attack, Longbow will regenerate health, and pretty quickly as well. I think it's if you don't hit them for 10 seconds, they'll regenerate health. That's if you want to get mastery for fruit, you could use your fruit to kill it. If you want to get mastery for your electric claw or sword, or maybe even gun, then you are going to want to kill the same boss, but instead with Awakened Buddha, so that when you shift, you go, it, like, you become enormous, and you get double the defense, so you only take half the damage, so it's practically double your life. And then with that, you can just spam your melee, or fighting style, until they're almost dead, then you can use your sword, fighting style, or gun to finish them off. This is a very effective method. After you've killed the boss, you can go to the top left, right here, to servers, and then when it refreshes, you come to this cursor down here, you hold on it, go somewhere around the middle, let go, and then choose another server. That way you can join that server, and it will most likely have the long run boss alive, so you can kill them, join a different server, and continuously do that so you can farm master really quickly. Something that really helps is the game pass double mastery. As you can see here, two times mastery. It says I already own it, and that's why I get double the mastery. Over here, it says times two, so it makes it much faster for you to grind. You can either trade for it, or you can just buy it with 450 Robux. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.